are doing fantastic i am doing great it is time for oh my god the mid season finale of power i'm i'm oh my god i can't i can't take it i was ready for this and everybody was telling me miss p this is the end it's over and i'm like no when it says mid-season finale that's what it means i've been doing this long enough that i know a mid-season means they coming back in the spring like they have to pull you along and this is the final season so i knew it wasn't going to end like that but baby the ending had me kind of shooketh, not because of, and we're going to talk about that in a second. So let me press pause. First of all, how y'all doing? I hope you're doing fantastic. Comment down below. Let me know what you thought about this episode. Let me know how you're doing. And also, I need you to answer the question, who shot Ghost? Put it down below. I want to know all your theories. We need to talk about it because I'm going to come back to this review right here. Okay, this one, not past ones, but this review right here when we come back to do the reviews in January, okay? When we pick back up on January 5 of 2020, I'm going to see, you know, who was right, okay? Because I even have my own theories, okay? I have my own theories, and we're going to talk about that down below. But make sure to go ahead and like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already, and follow your girl on social media at Miss TP90. And, you know, we normally be room roaming in my car, and I was ready today. I forgot now it gets dark whenever I get off of work. So, honey, that was enough. All right. So, we're in the office. Let's go ahead and get into this review. The way I'm going to break this down is who I think shot Ghost. And we're going to talk about Ghost and the different people. Okay. At the end. So Y'all should know by now that Ghost got shot. He showed it. Ghost was thinking I'm going legit. And I was just a key kid and laughing about that shit. Because I was like, ain't no damn way you going legit. There's no way you've done all of this shit for all these years. And you think you can just go on the straight and narrow. Now, granted, this is TV, sweetheart. So you're not going to be able to do that. And let me tell y'all, when Kanan popped up as a ghost, I said, whoa. Because I was watching it right here on my big ass TV. And when he popped up, I said, oh, shit. <laughs> but either way, um, Kanan really let him know, you ain't shit, nigga. And you ain't never going to be legit. And it's funny how he was wrestling with his past all through the episode. And you know me. I love me some ghosts, his fine ass. But I just knew it wasn't going to work out for him. He was feeling himself. He was too confident in this episode. Actually, confidence is great, but he was arrogant as shit in this episode. And I was like, ghost, it's not going to work out for you, boo-boo. This episode was long as hell, as I stated. Um, It was an hour and some change. And granted, I was real sleepy when I was watching this episode. So I fell asleep on a couple parts. So I don't know all the detailed details, but I know enough to do this. Y'all hush, you fell asleep too on a couple parts. Because some of those parts were like, okay, can we get to the meat? What are we doing? Like I said, uh, Ghost want to be legit. Mm -mm. He want to be with Ramona. Can we just talk about how he went to see um, Lil Raina's little grave site or whatever and Tasha was there and he was like, look at here, boo-boo cakes. I will give you this divorce that you want. We can be officially separated, but I'm moving on, Maya, okay? But I'm going to be with Ramona. I enjoy her. I really like her. We're going to have a nice little life together. And baby, we are no more. Okay? Thank you. You know, that's something that I can appreciate about Ghost's character. is him telling his ex, like, hey, this is it, Michael Jackson. I'm moving forward. I hope you have a wonderful life. Yes, I have somebody new. Just so you're not thinking and wondering. And we ain't doing this little bullshit dance no more. Child, we ain't been together. And I know you with other people. So I'm going to just leave you alone. Okay? And I can appreciate that. And hopefully, and the crazy thing, she was looking like shit. But yeah, it's over. But my only thing is, it's good that Ghost was trying to tie up all these loose ends, trying to be legit, wants to move on with somebody new. But baby, it's not going to be that easy, especially with all the dirt that you done been through, all the shit you done put people through. Honey, mm -mm, it's not going to be that easy. Now, the scene at the end was super intense because he was leaving truth. He was about to give Ramona some of that dirt. And then he was like, you know what? I'm about to bounce. This is a whole new, brand new, a whole new world Aladdin for me. And baby, out of nowhere, pop, pop, he's falling. Like, he's just like, <laughs> I was like, oh, he got shot? That scene, it was really, really intense. I love how they shot the scene with everybody like fast hustling to get the ghost. But ghost's part, when he fell and got shot, I was like, what kind of fall? 
dumb as this? Of course, there's symbolism in it. But while I'm watching it, I was like, why is he falling so slow? I get it. They were trying to show the dynamic of each person and why they were wanting to get to him. They only showed ghosts getting shot. They didn't show who did it because they wanted to show like, ooh, this is intense. This is what's going on. I see why they did it, but I don't like how the shot scene was, how he like fell over and was like, no. Nah. Like, it was like, uh-uh, I need some more intensity. Y'all are so damn intense on this show and you gonna give ghosts a, ah. And I also see why they did that again. See, I'm analyzing this when I'm talking about it because he's a main character. They want to show the severity of him finally getting got because this whole time he has been so invincible of sorts. So now he's getting shot and he's like, no. Nah. So I get it. There's different layers you can pull back for this. So, okay, I guess. So we're going to talk about the different people that have probably shot ghosts, okay? I'm going through each one. I might miss somebody. If I did, post it down below in the comments. But we gonna start out with Sax, okay? Because Sax was going through this episode, honey. He done lost weight. His lips is chapped. He ain't had nothing to eat. I just can't with Sax. Even though I can't stand his character. You know me. I just want to give him, I don't know, a sandwich or something and tell him it's gonna be okay. I want to give him some Panera broccoli and cheese soup. I don't know. He was just stressed. He even took out the gun. And was like, oh, I thought he was going to off himself. But then I saw that he was on a rampage to get the ghost. But also, the funny thing is, sex has nothing to lose. So for him to hear that, oh, my God, I done done all this work, done all this dirt, and I'm the one that's going to go to jail, and he going to be scot-free? Oh, hell no, somebody dying today. Now, do I think that Sax is going to shoot Ghost or be the one that shot him? No, I don't think so. I mean, he got balls, but he ain't got that much balls. Like, he one of them sneaky type of dudes that do stuff on the sly and get other people to do it and act like he did. Like, he that type of dude. I don't see him doing that. But the funny thing is, I never saw that look in that character's eyes. I know that this is TV, but I never saw that in Sax before when he was on that rampage. I said, oh, shit, he's slobbing and shit. Like, it's going down. Rob Regan. She was hustling too. She just nosy as hell and she takes her job really seriously and she has been an integral part of this season. Like I have to go ahead and give it to her because she has been putting pieces together and trying to do right. Tariq, do I think he popped his daddy? No, I don't think so. Even though he was acting super weird and super quiet this episode because I was like, you gave me everything I needed last episode and this one you real quiet. But the funny thing is he's trying to put some shit together and Tariq done been in a lot of shit. But do I think he offed ghost no i'm not gonna give it to Tariq either Tariq has had some big balls this season but i'm still not gonna give him that award of shooting ghosts i'm not gonna give that to him. max is making a special guest appearance but tasha huh baby girl she was shooketh though when ghost told her he was moving on maya she was shooketh but she been moved on okay and she just wants to be happy mary j blige but at the same time do i think she shot ghost I mean, even though he was doing some snitching and then he been back and forth and he yanked up and about choked it to death, do I think she shot, uh, well, shit, she shot Lakeisha? I don't know. Am I believing that, though, that she shot Ghost? No. I'm not going to say she the one who did it either, even though she shot Lakeisha and I was not ready for that and I was shook off of that one, but I don't think she shot Ghost. I really don't think so. I, I, didn't, I don't see it. Angie's sister, child. Baby girl, don't give a damn and she ain't got shit to lose and the way she was, it, it looked like she ain't slept in days. She was scratching all over the place. She was ready, Freddy. Now, do I think she shot Ghost? She's a, she's a wild card. I don't know. Even though she has motive to do it, I really don't think she pulled the trigger. I know she was ready or ready for war or whatever she was going to do. Do I think she pulled the trigger? I don't think so. I'm not giving it to her either. Even though she had that wild, crazy ass, I'm going to shoot your ass look in her eyes. I'm not going to give that to her. Ramona. No. Even Was Ramona even in the end with all of them? I don't know. It could be a crazy twist of events if she was really pulling his string this whole time. Ooh, that would be crazy. I don't know. But do I think that she was going to do it? No, she was ready for going. I don't think so. I'm going to take Ramona out of the run. Oh, Councilman Tate. Baby, he was on his minister society. He had his little hoodie on. Oh, I'm trying to tell y'all. Lorenz Tate, he a cute little sub. Like, he's so cute. And baby, the way that ghost was cutting all these people down. Like, one, chopping them down. He even did that to Dre. 
chopping them down, just making them feel this small. Like, I said, oh, and you could see that with Councilman Tate. Like, the way he was like, I'm the one, honey. I'm the one. Not you. You can't even do politics and this is your shit. I'm the one. I was like, oh, you shouldn't do that, ghost. Even with Dre, he was like, boy, bye. You need me. I was like, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Now, do I think Councilman Tate, could be in the running to do this. Yes, because he ain't got shit to lose, okay? He done lost everything, all right? Also, Dre, yes, he is in the running. I could see him doing this because does he have shit to lose? Yes, he does. But, yeah, I could see that. I really could. Which brings us to Tommy. Tommy really has nothing to lose. Do I think that he's the one who pulled the trigger? I don't think so because that's so what we're thinking. And no, I just don't think so. I don't think that the secondary character killed the main character. And that would seem so. Da -da -da. Um, hopefully there's a good spin on this. Now, as far as who I think is going to do it, I think it's going to be either Councilman Tate or either Dre. Okay, or somebody out of the woodwork that we know nothing about that I wasn't even thinking about. So that's why I say down below in the comments, please give your theories because I want to know who do you think shot ghosts? And like I said, I'm between Dre and Councilman Tate. I really don't think it was Tommy. I don't think it was Tasha. I'm not even thinking Tariq right now, even though Tariq is like a ringing bell right now, but I'm not going to give him all of that. Okay. So like I said, it's either between Councilman Tate or Dre in my opinion, but down below, let me know who do you think shot ghost? What did you think about this mid season finale? Are you continuing your stars account? Me personally? No, I'm done with stars till about January. Okay. January five. That's when I'm going to bring that back. But thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I've enjoyed doing these power reviews. I so appreciate all the love, all the support and you stay rocking with your girl so for that i can't say it enough i'm super appreciative but i will see all of you in the next video peace love and all that good stuff god bless bye